So we're kind of doing an arc. Not intentionally so, but not a bad thing. Certainly a more time consuming process this one. Just dropping the lines in takes a heck of a lot longer than uh, deep line fishing. And pulling them in is an equally much, much longer process. What's happened to my engine? Why had it reduced itself? Miserable work. Okay, maybe not miserable, but definitely wet. Two more to go. Okay, last one. We can take the uh, the other lines in or the catch from the two lines there, the two 250s, I think I'll probably sell those. Uh, and I'm just going to do one lot of, of line, long line fishing. Um, it's not something I particularly enjoyed in the first one. Um, and I want to try out all the other different fishing styles as well. So, we'll take them back to port, we'll sell what we've got, we'll wait for 20 hours and then we'll come back out and haul this lot in. And uh, that should be quite, uh, that should take quite a long time I imagine. If you get 15 fish on a 200 hook line, how many fish are you going to get on a 2000 hook line? Could be there, it could be 150 fish per line. <laughs> could be there forever. Could take me the rest of the week. But I've got two crew, so I'm hoping I can get them to do it. That's the other thing I want to test out, is whether or not I, they can take over these jobs. Like I say, I have no idea why he doesn't chuck them in the water. It just seems absolutely incapable of doing it. Now, the last time I fast travelled, I lost all of my catch. So, I'm going to try and be a little bit careful. Congratulations, you have successfully completed the long line tutorial. Oh, alright, thank you. devilishly close to the edge oh my gosh oh we so nearly hit that then all right completed the long line tutorial brilliant uh, fish on board would you like to sell your fish yes I would 21,000 wow that's really not very much at all cod haddock pollock and redfish good collection of fishy wish there Right, we're going to go to the fish market, we're going to go to fishing gear, we're going to sell our long lines. And that's that done. We're going to go to general, we're going to go to skip time. Uh, let's go to the map first and just check how long they've been out there. So, four hours. So, nearly five hours and four hours. Okay. So, let's go have a little sleep. Let's say skip time for... Do 14 hours. Come and check the crew. We've got two crew on board. Okay, let's get ourselves going. So here are the lights. Switch all the lights on. We're going to hit that. We are so going to hit that. We are so going to hit that. What would be really cool is if um, the wake from any passing ships really affected the boat as well. I don't know if you've ever been on a small boat in a port when a big boat comes past. <laughs> but uh, yeah, if you're, uh, if you're not confident in the water that's going to bring water to your eyes in more ways than you can imagine. What's that on the floor? It's flipping lobsters on, on the floor. Look. 
Who would have thought? Who would have thought? Alrighty, let's get ourselves out there. Already gone blue. It's not even been in there for 20 hours, that's cool. So I'm very much hoping that with this catch we put ourselves back to uh, over a million in the bank. And this isn't going to be the most profitable period of fishing for us because obviously every, every time I go back into port I'm going to sell what we've caught but then I'm going to change my rigging, buy new equipment so, um, just, just because I want to try out all the different types of fishing options that are available to us. thought I'd got too close to it then. Right, so how many fish are going to be on this line? Have a guess. What do you think? This fish is still alive, clearly. Wow. It's um, quite glitchy at the moment. And I'm having real problems actually seeing... Okay, it seems to have sorted itself out. Still only 15. So that's three fish I've missed. That's the first one we've caught. Wow. It is glitching out. Something rotten right now. Oh, man. I think that was a miss. Well, miracles do happen. miss bloody hell it's a bit unfair that the game is behaving this way and, and punishing me so that's another one I've missed just so glitchy the FPS is right down I don't know why Missed that one as well. That's a pretty disappointing set of catches. Got a few achievements though. Redfish, haddock and cod. 1,000 kilograms of cod. That's something I guess. Right, you sir, get on and hand gut that. You start hauling in the long lines. Let's get these guys actually doing some work as soon as I pay them a wage. Oh look! It's like swordfish in the vicinity again. So if I go to the map, can I... Yeah, look at this. Swordfish spotted a few seconds ago. Nice. That's cool. I like that. That's a great feature. So you can see he's gotten the fish there. 
can actually see the fish in his hand, which is nice. Definitely some issues with FPS at the moment, but hey. Right, let's get ourselves positioned correctly. Look at this, we've already got 4,755 kilograms of fish in the hole, in the hold. Um, so we're gonna be full up on two lines, which is rubbish. I mean, great, considering uh, how many fish I missed. But that's a big problem for us because A, I tried to get as maximum um, storage capacity, and B, what's the point in having eight lines if you can't actually pull them in so a few little problems there All right, let's see how well this goes I bet you I'm still expected to do the uh, the fish catching thing I hope not is he gonna do it himself he's gonna do it himself okay so depending on how good he is, that will dictate how many uh, how many fish we get out of this haul. But I wouldn't be surprised if we filled up com the ship completely just on this one line. One good thing is, I don't think he's going to miss as many as I did. My lovely wifey brought me a cup of coffee, so I'm just going to sit and enjoy that whilst we watch the fishing. Let me know in the comments guys, what do you think about this game so far? What are your opinions on it? I'm hoping uh, these performance issues will have been ironed out before release. If you've seen my earlier videos, um, on the version that I wasn't supposed to have um, you'll see that the performance is much better so I'm not sure what they've done to make it so bad but I'm pretty darn confident that whatever it is they'll be able to uh, resolve it pretty quickly hopefully before you guys get your hands on it we shall see shan't we Oh, you missed one, you pillock. You missed two, you pillock. If you miss this one, you're fired. Lucky. Lucky, lucky. Okay, a couple more achievements. In terms of pork and pollock and stuff. 6,000 kilograms, look at that. We are absolutely full. They've been in the water for 21 hours. If they're in there for 48, we lose them. So what am I going to do? There's no good situation. There's no good way of getting through this. We need that extra 7,000 kilograms of uh, storage. Seriously, badly. Um, Obviously laying 10 lines of 2,000 hooks in one go. Well, we haven't even got 10, I think we've got eight. So eight lines of 10,000 hooks, or nine lines of 10,000 hooks in one go. Completely unsustainable for this ship. There is no way we can get that many ship on board. So you're gonna have to split them up. You're gonna have to drop some, go back to shore, drop some more. I'm not sure how to make it work well. Yeah, I don't quite know. I don't quite know what to suggest on that one. Three lines is enough. Two lines technically is enough to get thirteen thousand. 
kilograms and we've got five times that amount which is a big problem so I'm going to haul in the next line which is going to unfortunately mean that we lose a lot of fish but we'll definitely go back to shore with 100% full Now, a lot of people um, in Fishing Barrent Sea suggested the idea that we have like a taxi service that would come out and take our fish off our boat onto their boat, take it back to shore at a cost. That way we can keep catching fish. We can keep hauling in the line. I think that's a really good idea and I'd very much like to see it happen. It would add a lot to the game, I think, and it would make situations like this much easier to deal with. Oh, it's actually telling us how well he caught this time. Probably because I turned the HUD off. If I turn the HUD off, does he do it? He does. And what's really quite interesting, I don't know if you spotted that. Oh, you flipping missed one. If you look at the fish in the uh, in the box, it looked to me like they were moving, but I think they're just sliding about. So okay, don't worry. I thought they were still alive. I, th I thought, wow, that's really quite cool. We got a perfect. All right, that resets your uh, that resets your situation. One missed. So the ocean, I've got to say, looks pretty good. I haven't seen any bad weather yet, except for when I went off the edge of the map. Um, and I mean that looked pretty cool but it wasn't as rough and dangerous as I really hoped it would be in this version of the game still looks too too mild I mean for somebody without particularly good sea legs you would definitely be throwing up all over the place it wasn't a mill pond by any stretch of the imagination but So we got exactly 13,000, oh there, we threw 4,000 away. Right, this is going to be a problem. What's the closest port? Definitely you here. I don't think I needed to go so far into sea. I think I could have probably set those lines here. So there's nothing else for it. I'm going to have to go back to port. Sell what we've got and then come back again. Yes, I'd like to fast travel there. Fish on board, would you like to sell your fish? Yes, I would. 78,000 revenue. That is small fry, isn't it? Considering the amount of work we have to do to get that fish. That's not good a, a good return at all. get ourselves back out there guys I'm not sure why the camera is forcing me in this close how many out oh look we're losing fish thick and fast and that's at 22 hours so dramatically diminished returns in just the space of two hours. So you don't want to leave them out there for 20 hours and then pull them in. You want to pull them in as they reach 20 hours. You don't want to go over that period, I don't think. So 
we're just going to pull all these lines in, we're going to take the fish in, that's really quite a small return on those fish. I don't think I'll be doing any long line fishing again, it just, it doesn't seem worth it. Certainly not in this boat, or in any boat, True, truth be told, we were making far more money deep lining. What's cool is um, when you've got crew members on the ship, they um, instigate the pull. So I don't have to press any buttons or anything, I just have to line it up, which is nice. Let's have a look at it from first person perspective. A few little issues I think with the game. Strange behaviour. Definitely the FPS has dropped right down again. Let's um let's drop everything down here. Let's put everything on medium. Definitely better. Doesn't look too bad either. Doesn't look awful. We'll just watch our crew haul this in, I guess. Okay, looking good. I'm not sure why you haven't started gutting any fish. I mean, there are fish there to be gutted. That's the last one in, and away you go. All right, cool. So that's just the way it's designed in the game, which is not necessarily a terrible thing. So let's see how hard it is to haul this in from first person. We've got the radar to help us. Definitely need to upgrade my binoculars. So this I think is a fish finder. Sonar. 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 Goody, goody, goody. You can see that we've got a little light on these and a little flag to indicate that we have a catch. And there he goes. The job's a good one. Whoa! 
Mexican jumping fish, they're my favourite. You missed that one. If you miss three in a row, you're fired. Just so you know. No pressure. So we've got one tray of fish there. Oh, wow. Careful, dude. You're going to have your hand off. Jeepers, creepers. It's fast, though. Very fast. So realistic, I can almost smell the fish. In fact, interesting fact, fresh fish don't smell. I bet you didn't know that, did you? So they tell me. Good job, lads. Good job. Next one. So how are we doing? Yeah, this is probably going to take us over the limit. It's almost better for us that we've got... that we've waited so long and we're going to get really terrible returns on these. Because we're just wasting fish. Definitely need to upgrade this engine. This is a poor engine. Wow, 5,000 kilograms of fish totally lost. We've got another three lines to haul in. That's not good. I guess I could go back to shore, sell everything we've got, and come out and get these before they sink and disappear. But I don't think we're going to make very much money off them at all. I keep forgetting you could do that. Yes, sell my fish at Yarmouth. 78,000 again. Really not good. Certainly this is not the most profitable way of fishing. Kind of makes me wonder what would be the point in choosing this again. some orange if they start going red it's gonna be a nightmare all right let's get these in let's get these in let's get them home let's sell them and let's get this goddamn stuff off our boat there's got to be something better than this that we can do with this ship let's get some lobsters on the go perhaps
Okay, what happened there then? Slight alignment issue. Over to port, we have a little shoal of uh, swordfish. So definitely worth... It's probably closer than that, actually. Oh, once you put it there, you can't move it. Okay. It's a one-time thing. Put it in the wrong place, and you're done for. I mean, I assume they're... Uh, Swordfish, I can't really see from here. Yeah, they're definitely swordfish. Thought for a second they might be dolphins.
One to go guys, nearly there. You can see how late it's got. Very late at night now. Sun's going down, looks pretty awesome, a bit flashy for some reason, not sure why that is. Very much hoping they get these uh, performance improvements in place pretty soon. But you can see how awesome this game is going to look once it's settled down, polished up and finished off. There's something over there beyond my last line and I can't tell what it is. Are there two more? There are two more in the water. We have 11 lines, I thought we only had 10. Goodness me. So we should go in with nearly another full uh, full load, which is pretty good considering they're all orange and they've been in the water far too long. So not a bad turnaround. I'm glad I dropped off the previous load now and came back out. I almost didn't do it. Very glad I did. Made, made a lot more profit. That's a terrible attempt at lining up with that. Oh, <laughs> what? Well, that surprised me. I didn't think that was going to work at all. And the sun is gone. Look at that. Beautiful. couple more achievements let's go grab in that last line if I can see it seems like I still can't use the searchlight properly there it is I see the line Last one, we're going to be slightly, slightly below a full load, but that's another 80,000 in the bank. And we're just going to take it back to shore, sell it all and just get rid of it. Um, this whole long lining saga has not been a pleasant one. I don't suspect I'm going to be in any rush to come back and do this again. myself better this time. Bit of late night fishing completed. So like there's another similar looking boat out there doing the same thing. Obviously saw our lines and thought, hey up, they found fish. Okay, so we got nine, nine and a half thousand kilograms on board. That's not too bad at all. We'll get these guys to rest. Is he tired? I'm not sure what, what's going on there. Which one of these is better at 
and gutting. Oh, definitely you. Rudy Smith is definitely the hand gutter. Which sounds like an insult, but it's not. Whoa, okay. Still got to pay attention. Don't want to be bumping into anybody out here. Strange how the AI boats have nobody on board. It'd be really cool if they had animated AI on board as well. And you sort of wave at each other as you pass, that would be amazing. Okay, getting slightly off topic here. Let's go back to port. I keep forgetting I can do this. Fish on board, yes we'd like to sell them, 50,000 in the kitty, we're over a million, let's go to the fish market, let's sell our fish gear. Quite a bit back off that, we, I, think, I think we made more money from selling our fish lines than we did fishing with them. Um, okay, so if we go to the dock, look at our rigging options. So we're currently rigged for longline fishing. We can rig for net fishing, rig for lobster fishing, and deep line fishing. Deep line fishing is just a brilliant money-making scheme. I'm going to set us up for some lobster fishing. Join me in the next episode where we'll do some of that. And uh, yeah, we'll take on the tutorial. And uh, that'll be cool. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Till next time. Goodbye.